Yeah, we gon' talk, we gon' have fun. We be on fire, we be lit lit. It's a unique hustle. Big, big. Check it, check it, check it. It's a unique hustle. It's your boy ECEO, and I'm here with the lovely, amazing, official, outstanding. All that other stuff I be saying. I'm good at this mic stuff, man. Mic check, man. Boss Talk 101, man. Miss Jamaica. Y'all be having a lot of fun together. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of fun together, man. Y'all been together for a minute, man. 20 yeah, years, you know, man. Going. Blessing. That's a hard court. What? Oh, yeah. Go I ain't saying it, but y'all know. Okay. Y'all need to go like, subscribe, follow us <laughs> on our social media platform. I mean, our TikTok, Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, even Threads. Y'all ain't on Threads. Y'all need to get on Threads because I be spitting some good knowledge on Threads, y'all. Motivational stuff, y'all come on, join our threads. It gonna pick you up and keep you up, all right? But definitely follow our YouTube membership. That's where you see our, our full length interviews. None of the clips, none of the interruptions, none of the anything. And some exclusive stuff is on there too. So if y'all wanna go ahead and support the brand, Boss Talk 101 on all platforms. Man, listen, Miss Jamaica, our guys here again, man. This is our, this is the, the guide for me. This is the greatest comedian. Listen, when he come on, I'm being real with you, man. I watch his skits every time. I've been at the shows. I know what he brings to the table. His stand-up is, listen, unmatched. Bubba Dub's in the building, man. What it do, everybody? What it do? What it do? I'm glad to be back. Man, I'm glad to have you back, man. I, I seen you, man. I, I'm going to go right on into it, man. You was on a, a plane. A jet, a jet, a w something, jet. and the nigga walked up and say, so yeah, play. yeah, yeah, mama, I'm, 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 I, I got this, man. I'm, I'm, no, nah, hell, no, nah, I ain't carrying that nigga like no more. Maybe well, it, I'm done with that, man. And and next thing you know, y'all was in in a skit together, man. Yeah, like, yeah. how did y'all even come up with that? And what made y'all even do it? That came from Floyd. Yeah, that came from him. Like, you know, it was raining that day. We was headed to L.A. He had a. Um, he had to go pick up a bag. You know what I'm saying? He's As like, usual. He's like, Bubba Dub, what's up? What's your schedule? I'm like, man, I got to get back to the high. Like, nah, nigga, I'm kidnapping you for a couple of days, man. I got to get bag to get. Let's go get it. So we just, you know what I'm saying? It was raining real bad. We just jumped on the plane. He was like, hey, let's do something. Let's let's put something together. I told him to play. Shit, he executed it. It is what it is, you know? Man, I seen that thing, man. It ain't playing this short going crazy. I seen it. I was like, yeah. these boy going crazy on here. Mm -hmm. So, like, like. What, how much preparation going to say? Is it just natural? Natural. One take Floyd Jake? I think he a comedian, man. One take Jake? That was two, that was two, two takes. takes. That was two okay. takes, that one. But he, Floyd think he a comedian, so, you know, he joking all day long any damn way. He, he be joking? All day long. Man, that's the, that's, I think that's what's hard, man, when you got an organic relationship where somebody, you know, they just pretty much just doing their thing, man. You know what I'm saying? I seen him when he was messing with that money like he was. I knew he was different. All that damn money he used to just be messing around with. Man, that dude, that dude house is like his rooms, man, he got shoes stacked up to the ceiling. I ain't just talking about his closet. I'm talking about every room he got, he got fucking shoes like, Louis Vuitton, he gonna wear Jordans. Louis Vuitton, all that red ball, your shoe gets stacked. It's just crazy. Damn, we just crazy, man. Man, oh, I, I just I, I'm gonna be real with you. I, if I could just get me, you know, just a little bit of that money he got, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, and get me. I don't have to own the plane, but I got to be able to rent it or borrow it sometime. Well, I, I, well, I tell you, like he tell me. Anybody can get a plane, but can you keep it? It's the maintenance. Mm -hmm. The maintenance. And Floyd can tell you he ain't flew commercial in twenty five years. Wow. Wow. So yeah, that maintenance got to be that gas. You know, like when you get gas in the Escalade, you looking at the pump like, damn. But we better when you're in Cali or something, and the pump just keep going. It's almost to one eighty or one sixty. You like what the? We went to L A. and back. It was twenty thousand. See what I'm saying? For like, what the gas? Floyd. It was like Floyd. Uh, you know, you got to you know, pay for this. He gave him his card and looked at it. He said, Doug, look at this, 20000 One the, trip. One trip for the gas to go to 20, 000, yeah. L.A. and back, 20 bands. 20 bands. That's crazy. Yeah. But his 20 bands, to me, would well, be like. he paid like he weigh, though. So let me say that. Let me cut you out. He paid like his way. He paid like he weigh. So, mm. so he, he throw an more, extra. He paid he pay, he pay more than. Mm. Anybody else gonna pay? They mm. just, they just money. You gonna do that? He gonna do it. So he got if, this. if he owe you a hundred, he gonna give you ten thousand. Mm. <laughs> I like that. That's, that's just him. Mm. That's just him. That's just how he roll. That's Capri and I. That's just how he roll. That's just how he roll. 
I guess, yeah. Man, you That's know. That's crazy. And, 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 you know, for him, I mean, I know he get he gets a little Can't bored. Can't take it with you. You got to no. think about it. This man, and you know, he pretty much never got beat in boxing. And then you think about how he's basically kept himself relevant, you know, doing the exhibition fights, all the stuff that he's done, you know. Um, he was in a few movies. I seen him in Think Like a Man back in the day. You know, <laughs> he, Kevin Hart tried. He did, he just did a little cameo like, let me do this. You know what I'm saying? Like, like that's crazy. I'd like to see him and you in a movie together. That oh, would be yeah, hard, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. That would be hard, man. I ran across him. I ran across some things. I talked to him about a couple of things, stuff like that. That would be hard. I ain't gonna lie to you. I, I love to see it because, like I said, man, the movie thing is, is, is really what a lot of people, now they own this Tubi. I've been interviewing man, a lot of people on, on that Tubi. Too, I be on it. I watch it too. But I'm saying, you I'm, watch Tubi a lot. Well, I'm on it. Tubi got them. Tubi got them low budget ones where Duh. you can spend twenty, or thirty, maybe forty, and you. Duh, when your movie coming out on Tubi? <laughs> <laughs> we got the ass though. God damn it, we got the ass. I'm on Tubi. We got the ass. Go and check me out, baby. That damn Tubi. What you think about Tubi? Is it, is it ain't that bad, man. <laughs> and you know what? I ain't got no choice but to like it. I'm on it. I'm not gonna dislike nothing I'm on. You know, That's people true. on Tubi doing their thing. That's Shout true. out to y'all. I'm on Tubi, but I wanna grow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I Jamal Woodard. I went down there. He, he, That's the Tubi God. He mm -hmm. owned that thing. I interviewed him. He, he owned it too. And, and you know, he really take it serious. You know, when you talk to him about it, he like, yeah, man, I'm gonna get in these movies. He really own it. Like, he yeah. stay on one. Mm -hmm. What did you do? You when you be watching too big, just go to the next movie. Mm -hmm. You know, you, it suggests on you mm -hmm. for real. That whole suggests on you. For real. I said, damn, this whole I'm finna watch this. I whole, like, yeah. I like to suggest because then you come across a movie that you're like, dang, he played in that. How did I not see that yet? But Tubi be bullshitting. Like one man a nigga got dreads, the next man they got a ball fade. Like, come on, man, come on, Tubi. Y'all be bullshit. No, ain't be. They don't be fit. They had they show the clothes up on the stomach. Woman ain't pregnant. Come on, man. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. That's we the only thing better. I can't stand about Tubi. Yeah. Why? At one the, what point, about, I stopped about watching about because of stuff. that. The lightning, the audio. Yeah. <laughs> yep. The lightning, the audio. I hate, I hate the dark movies. I hate the low budget on the movies. <laughs> I looked up one so, of my uncles was for a film in one of the movies. That ain't got no money, man. <laughs> But not all of them. Some movies on Tubi is good quality. I'm going to say that. Some of them be bullshit, man. Yeah, you know There's a man. bunch of them that yeah. you be looking like, damn, man, is it a shadow? Nigga got a camera. Yeah. Is this a bootleg? Yeah. 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 Nigga, I'm like, That's for real, bootleg. nigga shot one on iPhone 4. <laughs> man, come on, man. <laughs> Tubi. But Tubi giving niggas an opportunity. They, they all give they, yeah. they all giving an opportunity. Yeah. So she, I'm, I want to get paid. To get real pay, because I'm hearing some big numbers. Like when you start getting them, like like Jamal got a lot of them floating. Well, he different because he did that movie with you know. Yeah. So he, and the barbershop. Yeah, so he you know he gonna get a little different. Mm. You know they gonna saying? watch him. Yeah, yeah, they gonna watch him. So it's been some on there. Nigga, like nigga won't get seventy five hundred. <laughs> nah, nigga, I want seventy five hundred. Nigga, I want fifteen. <laughs> Hey man, let me ask you, man. Them Cowboys won forty to what? Forty and zero. <laughs> forty and zero. When he found out, he said, "Ooh, Bubba oh, got forty and zero." Forty and zero. That's the first thing he thought I about. Do I said, Boy, Mama, we back. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, let me tell you. Yeah. Let me tell you. They're always back during this time of the year. Don't, yeah. don't start. We go hard. But playoffs. It's different. But we playoffs go hard. is different. totally different. This year. Different, Mama. This year. So you feel like this year is the year? And them niggas already tailgating, Mama. We already mm. out there. Normally, nigga tailgate on Saturday. Nigga been tailgating since Monday. <laughs> it's <laughs> on in the city, All baby. The Hispanics got their jerseys on everywhere I go. There's Coronas everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> man, them cowboys, man. They, I think this is your fault. It, it, it is. Boy, they, they got to be. Boy, they be hating what we got to be. be. <laughs> I think this is the year for us, I, baby. I feel it though, man. I ain't never felt. I ain't felt in a long time. <laughs> Look, we won forty and zero, and Dak wasn't even that good. Yeah, that first game. Yeah. You felt the last time before you um, burned that the jersey. Was the perks. <laughs> that was the perk days. <laughs> I'm back on Lord Town now. <laughs> Yeah, by the end of the year, we gonna show y'all. And when we win the Super Bowl, oh, it's you, different. It's different. You know what it is. The whole you world shut say, down. You can't say that because when was I the last time? It. When was the last time y'all won the I Super Bowl? I watched it. It was in the nineties. It was in the nineties. You know how long ago that is? It don't matter. If we was down. They the, say last time we won, Barry, Barry White, RIP, was one hundred seventy pounds. <laughs> <laughs> I think. 
think that when what Barry Swisher got caught with the gun at indeed, the airport. Indeed. Yeah. So yeah, they said we, Michael Irvin was sweating like barbecue. Michael meat. Irvin is so you know right now he caught up on the Colorado thing. I got to ask you about Prime. Prime in this whole looking good, man. man. Prime doing his thing, bro. Everybody going down there. That's who everybody watching right now, bro. Every game seemed like the Super Bowl when this nigga got, he walked he out. He different. He different, he, man. He make a nigga feel good when he walk out there on that Prime field. Prime different, man. He, he get a lot of hate though. I don't care. He I love it, man. man. You know, John Taylor, my boy, they all hang out with him. That's dope. So yeah. I'm, I'm loving that. You know my prediction when the what Cowboys going to win? Oh, you going back to my boys. The Cowboys going to win that game whenever Prime be the coach. Mm, that ain't going to never happen. It ain't happening. Jerry and them, they Jerry got the whole lockdown. that nigga. But Why? They love him, but they ain't hiring that nigga. Prime time is demanding. He's the star. He he love he's going to be the star. It's a difference. Prime, no, he's so the that star. That's never going to happen. That's never going to happen. He'll be the coach of the Atlanta Falcons. Yeah. Prime time will be the coach of the Atlanta <laughs> Falcons before he be the care coach of the Dallas. Dallas Cowboys will never have a black coach. Let me say that. Ever. Ever. Long, not long as Jerry a lot And it's probably in the wheel Yeah Yeah He yeah. gets yeah. certain things Set in stone baby But Jerry man mm -hmm. Jerry different mm -hmm. man Jerry is a real entrepreneur All the years that the Cowboys Was not supposed to be You know all that They they merged So I sold everybody You gonna continue that, That's America's <laughs> team It's Jerry He's a great marketer Man you can't knock Jerry on that and I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm, I'm a Jerry Jones fan. I don't, I don't know who I older him or him Steven. I heard you say that. <laughs> I don't know who <laughs> older him or Steven. Jerry ain't Asian no more. No. Jerry got them hoes, man. I'm telling y'all, man. Y'all gonna be wanting to say he's staying scandals, but he a billionaire. That's how you keep getting out of him. He remind me of Hugh Hefner. That's who he is. That's who he reminds me. They all me flock out. together. He cold with it. He cold, cold with Jerry it. Jerry a real pimp, allegedly real pimp. Pimp really? hand strong. He ain't strong. He used to be a little shaky now. He <laughs> strong though. His hand like potato salad. You ever seen? You know when you get older, the <laughs> white people hands and shit get purple and blue and like potato uh, salad. But it's a good thing pimping. I don't eat potato salad. He's still pimping, though. <laughs> oh yeah, the boy, the boy read it, and and you know I thought his son was gonna come out of college. Grandson, I thought he was gonna come out of college. <laughs> all, that, all that hype behind that. He didn't do it, did he? Trash. He couldn't do it. He, he ain't. He ain't got two, but why? Everybody in Jerry family, they're not he got football that name. players. That's all he got. He, he, he listen, don't need I'm going to tell you something. I told your partner, which is uh, uh, Deion Sanders' son. Mm -hmm. Junior. We was, not, yeah, yeah, Junior. We was up in Vegas. What I tell him, I, he say, man, I, he, they were saying, man, he's selling clothes. I said, nigga, that nigga daddy play football. I don't want, that nigga ain't selling footballs or jerseys or talking about football. I ain't doing it. Then years later, he still sold clothes all them years. Yeah, well you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. it, 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 mm -hmm. uh, goat was it? Yeah. it Go. Yeah. He says well off a lot. Doesn't yeah. hit. Doesn't yeah. hit. Doesn't hit. Doesn't hit. Mm -hmm. And he good with that camera too. Yeah, he is. The nigga nice with the camera. He got the, that that social media stuff. And I mean, they they hold little old presence is nice, man. Mm -hmm. And you can't do number win around oh oh uh uh, uh Dion. Uh, mm -hmm. Can't do number win. Man. You can't do number win around. He ain't gonna let you lose. That nigga got a hell of a daddy on it, boy. Fuck my daddy ain't worth a damn. Fuck my daddy, man. And I love my daddy the devil. Fuck my daddy, man. God. Man, it's hard if you measure them all like that. You wrong, man. You right. You can't measure them on that type my of... Daddy real nigga, though, man. Damn, man. <laughs> Fuck, why my pops gonna be like Prime, man? Man, Prime walked through, it and he make him feel good. I seen him talking to that boy. I said, this is good. And the boy, the boy got something at quarterback. And do. And do. Like... All that he can't play in the big league. Shit, he's showing that, that you. Going, that nigga going to, to the pro. He going, bro. And his, and his daddy probably gonna go with him. He it. can see the field like a cheetah. He know he it. can see the field. He's scanning. He's first option, no. Second option, no. Third option, no. Four, I'm out of there. Like he one, two, three, second. Ain't nobody open. He taking off with it. He got like, it. He got Brady. Like he, he the luxury of having the father's prime time is being around. Other stars in the game to learn the game. He been learning the game since uh, five, five years, years old. So old. he see what we don't see. Man, God got it. Yeah. So I mean, ain't nothing you can do about it. You can't do nothing but tip your hat off to him. And you know it is what it is. Like, like I was good at sports too, but my baby mama new boyfriend she a stud. She was cold. So I have her take him, my son to the games now. <laughs> like real talk. I don't even take him no more. I let fam she take him. Cold. Yeah, she wearing the jersey as dad instead of me. I'm in the cut, just watching. But she might try to be more of a dad than she you. Is. She raw, <laughs> and she good with these. She used to box Layla Ali. 
Yeah, a spawn partner. She ever she ever came to you and like No, we got into a little something she knocked me out, but <laughs> we ain't talk about that on boss talk one on one, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all gotta give me a hundred thousand to tell that story, <laughs> man. You know what I'm saying? But she cold go. Man, so how's the show going, man? Great, great, well, great. Like like that's one of the things that I seen in you when you sprung off into that, man. I didn't know I was like, man, I don't know how you gonna do on it. But you killed it, bro. Like and, and, and a real leader, like standing in the you know, you you right there in the hey, right right where you positioned to be man so how 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 is it just being on that side of it interviewing people talking to people it's cool but i'm more of a one on one person okay. i really like being by myself controlling everything by myself and just d working in that way because a lot of times people gonna match your energy like you and mama y'all got energy together like when i'm with other people it'd be cool but sometimes their energy don't be with mine again and i just like to just don't go mm -hmm. you know what it I'm takes saying? time to build that energy yeah well it's, it's a it's a certain chemistry mm -hmm. <laughs> but you th you think about it i seen you when you was talking to and you 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 was wrong <laughs> wrong as hell. you was talking to bud crawford and you told yep. the nigga you yep. said in eight he knocking your ass out but that was just entertainment i know that but still you hit that and when you told him that though it, it the way you were controlling the whole conversation it's entertainment that was clean though. That was yeah. good. That like you had everybody, everybody listening. You were talking to him, and that y'all worked that out. Like, but deep, but that was that was early January when we shot that last year. But down the line, I had start building the you build relationships with people mm -hmm. that you interview. Right, exactly. And shout out to Earl Spence. I don't know Earl. I never mm -hmm. met Earl, so I have a relationship with Bud. Bud, but mm -hmm. I was talking shit to Bud. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But in the same time, but y'all gonna know this, <laughs> behind the scenes and the DMs and text messages, I was rooting for, uh, I was rooting for Bud. Bud. Wow. You know wow. what I'm saying? I was rooting for Bud, cause I was like, man, you know, glad y'all finna fight. I hope you pull it out. But in the in, inside, I was like, fuck, I'm from Texas. That shit hurt, didn't it? We, got, we only got one box out here really doing our thing. Right. We, we really. Did you uh, feel disloyal? Hell no. <laughs> Hell no, I didn't. Earl got 30 million for that fight. <laughs> I know, but you're not from he Texas. Good. He got but 30 he, million. He ain't where you from is where you at. True. Well, he telling the truth so, now. So, you know what I'm saying? He Earl got, got that 30, 30 million. million. He got beat up, whatever. He gonna bounce that back. That nigga done healed. Yeah, he good. He gonna come back. 30 million, he good. You think he gonna fight him again? Yeah, he gonna fight him. We don't know why, but he gonna fight him. <laughs> he get in there. He gonna get in there. You think he gonna win? I think he need to leave that shit alone. But that ain't my place to say I'm not no boxer. Hey man, but you watching yeah. the sports to know. Yeah, I mean, he won't just get back. I ain't look. I can't fight. You think he can get it back? Hell no! But she is. <laughs> yeah, he gonna get thirty million again. He gotta should get in more, there. Nah, it should be more this no, time. No, no, he gotta nah, get nah, in there. Nobody really gonna watch less. it like that. They gonna watch it, but I want everybody. I want them to get their money. But yeah, oh, Mama, did you see that? Did you mm, see the fight? He knocked him down with a jab. We were there together. He knocked no, him saying, down with a jab. That? Something ain't right. Yeah, yeah, he yeah. get hit with a jab and fall. Yeah, something ain't right. It, yeah, something ain't right. It remind me of how my my my, my baby mama boyfriend did me at my son's birthday party. Get out of there! Not the pre cum out of me. <laughs> he said, get, 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 yeah, get, get out of there! 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 Get out of Get up, shit, he gone. I made sure that nigga gone before I got up. <laughs> oh. Get out of there! Oh. Oh. <laughs> get out of there! Coach get Cliff? out of there! I was texting. <laughs> that nigga really gone? Yeah, he gone. I gotta go on up. How oh. long did you lay down there before you got up? 37 minutes. <laughs> shit, get out of there! I Ooh. tried to shoot a playground. <laughs> shit, if I could. Like, you got to get out of there, man. I got press charges on him, though. <laughs> nah, for real talk. Nah, to. it's a true story. He in jail now. Really? Yeah, we had to go to court behind that shit. Forty years. Won't touch nobody else. He getting touched. He got, yeah, he getting he touched now. Forty Yeah, quid. not the way he want to get touched <laughs> either. Nigga <laughs> getting touched. <laughs> Man, I, I got a question. Ahead, ahead. Uh, so, um, you know, with being in, in comedy, mm -hmm. and I've seen where um, sometimes comedians, they disagree, they get into it and stuff like that. And I would never think that comedians get into it they do. at all. They do. But I saw recently where Scruncho oh, and TK hey. Kirkland, they got into it. But I saw where Faison posted like they made up. Cause they probably did. So I, I was happy about that because I don't like to see people get TK into it. TK 75, man. Man, Scruncho came over here. He's young. Yeah. TK, he don't need to be so out there. Like, cool think about all Scruncho of that. Scruncho cool dude. No, he cool because we I met, met him. I met the homie, man. Nigga he bought some out of Boss Talk. Mm -hmm. That's the, he one of them real ones. You're 
But I, but I I didn't want to see nobody get hurt. But I seen that. Right. But I'm gonna be honest with you, man. They they man. When you get this age, man, you don't need to get hit. Man, with no TK pipe. two year men in nursing home. Bro, no that's fucking way. He's not that old. She ain't sixty something. He sure is. He, he was just a number. Oh, he was that don't matter. Your ass sixty year old. <laughs> that nigga was in the funky enough uh, video with DOC. Damn, dancing. <laughs> They said that nigga with the backup dancer for Al Green. <laughs> Shit. That nigga old, man. <laughs> Shit. I fuck with TK. I love his comedy. Me too. But the, he don't, he don't look need here. to be trying to fight nobody. No, he gonna look. He, but he said, don't need to be trying to fight nobody. He just meet me down though. here. Just gonna meet me over here behind the fat burgers. Who raised you? <laughs> Don't do it. Don't go over there. But what I like, I like the fact that they came back together online. Because sometimes people make up behind closed doors. But then whenever you, you know, have a disagreement in public, Some you need to make up over Jello pudding at the nurse home. <laughs> oh, man. Right. Like, hey, Jell-O man, Jell-O we, we made them look. Then we, we, oh, man, we made them look. Man, get your ass out the way before we get killed. All this money out here. I don't like to see my brothers fighting. Man, it yeah. just wasn't yeah, a good look. Man. Good look TK got all. bigger problems. So they've been on his ass for a minute. So. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So let. Let me let, let me be real, which I seen you again, and we talked about it before. This you and Mikey up, y'all mm-hmm. linked up again. What? Tell me what that was like, cause that was just I went to his crib, man. You know, Mike. Oh, you at the nigga house, man. Mike, y'all yeah, wrong, man. Niggas don't invite me over to comedian. Mike done by his whole neighborhood, bro. I heard. Mike got I like saw ten that. houses, man. I saw that's that. Crazy. And, I saw and, he, and, he, and his baby young, so he keep his, that. he keep that nigga running. Who was it that oh, came up to him? Was baby. it Fifty who came up to him and congratulated? I saw something online. Might have been Fifty. It might yeah, have been came 50. up to him and congratulated him on you know, and gave him some. I think he gave him some shades. Who was no, that? No, that was that was Damon Dash. Damon Dash. That's Damon who did. it was. But yeah, Damon. And I was like, that's dope. Damon Dash, a cool nigga though. Mm-hmm. But I'm just being honest with you, man. The nigga got a little Damon, baby. Let me cut you out. Damon a different nigga. Mm-hmm. I love man. Damon, I love Damon. Damon was down there in Indianapolis man. telling white people what to do at their own it. event. I love it. What's your name, Susan? You get your motherfucking ass over here. I love that nigga Damon. Hell, you bro. I remember when we seen him. He speaks his mind. He do. That's it, one thing I like about him. He speaks he his mind. Yeah, he made us look good on that panel. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he made us look good on that panel, man. And he for black folks. That's one thing I love about him. He is. He, he's... Dame is definitely for us. He's he's a little hard. A lot of people take what he say to heart, but he don't mean no harm. He just wants you to do better. He wants you to boss up like boss talk one on one. Wants you to boss up. Wants you be. Wants you to own some shit mm-hmm. in case some shit happen. You own this. Mm-hmm. Nobody own you, mm-hmm. and that's his view. And it helped me open up my eyes to some shit too. Like man, what you, know, you want to own? Everything. Anything everything. I touch, I want to own. At least have ownership in it. Cause at the end of the day, why should they make a hundred million and I make ten? Mm-hmm. Why can't I make seventy and they make thirty? See, that's the Floyd mentality that I get from him as well on shit, man. It's all about ownership. He not doing shit unless it's favorable. That's why I like the generation that we're in because you know, yes, we have this generation have a lot of bad, but I like the way how they're more vocal because back in. 20, 30 they, years ago, people wasn't talking about owning, niggas, owning, owning, owning. These niggas vocal, but these niggas on powder. These niggas on powder like fentanyl. motherfucker, mama. That too. That knock them out. That too. But I'm telling you, I, I want to go back to Dame a little bit, man. I just always admired his, his like you said, the, 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 I'm going to be independent. I'm going to oh. own this and I'm going to help my people to own something. You don't see that much. A lot of people talk down and say whatever, but the dude, it, it, to me, is just a, a, a real. Uh, entrepreneur and mm-hmm. and I always rock with him. So shout out to Dane, man, and uh, I got to get him on Boss Talk One Hundred and One mm-hmm. for sure. Um, man, like so, being with Mike Epps, what do you some things do, do, when you see his comedy and the way he carry his whole dynamic? What what do you see in him for as uh, being because he like the OG in the game for you, right? Mike is smart, and it's all about marketing with more. I mean, but well, um, Mike, Mike, if you know this, what he did. He took what he did in the movies and brought it to the stage. No matter where he goes, he's dang mm-hmm. Yeah. He's yeah. going to sell out regardless. Mike said in 10, 12,000 tickets. Dang That's hard. All he got to do is come out there and grab a mic. It's up. It's up. I like it. And the reason I, I, I just see how 
Man, the movies, I was watching All About the Benjamin the other night. Like, shoot, I rocks with them nigga movie. That nigga can act. That's an acting nigga. He got, he, it's just certain roles, man. Think about this. I ain't, never, ain't, ain't nobody never looked at it like this. And me and him had this conversation. I, I shared with y'all right here on Boss Talk. I ain't never told this. Mike Epps had to come behind Chris Tucker mm-hmm. on mm-hmm. Friday. Mm-hmm. We all know how great Chris Tucker was on Friday. Mm-hmm. Mike Epps was so good, we never complained. Or compared. Compared. We want Chris Tucker to come back, all three of them. Remember, we want all of them to come all back. Them to come but back. we never complain like, damn, we miss Chris Tucker, man. He ain't Mm-mm. hit no more. Mm-mm. Think about how good Mike Gibbs had been for that to happen. That's true. Yeah, that nigga pulled That's that true. off, though. That nigga pulled it off, bro. And he told me he, 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 he came to L.A. from New York on a bus with $1,200. Damn. And made that shit happen. He had to make it happen. That Michael nigga, real G man And nigga, he gave man. me some game I can't share Yeah But he a real OG And he won't see me come up And yeah. not only me But others as well But mm-hmm. man It feel good when he stomp you He really do it Yeah, feel good yeah. Everybody else can tell you It's cool You take the compliment But when Mike else tell you that That shit feels good man Man Mike else man Nigga to keep you laughing Every damn time For real though You know when you watch um, Comedy or Just like if you watch movies And you see certain people act And every movie that they come in They act about Almost very similar You know what I mean In my mind I'm always like That has to be how They really are in person well, How is he in person? Mike Epps in person. He, he's a little bit of uh, what you see like, in the movies. That's what I was wondering. But he's a little bit more reserved. He's, he, he, I would say this, in case the people don't know. He got a little Michael Mixon. Oh, yeah. really? Knowledge-wise. Mm. And as far as how he, how he thinks. Yeah. Not. I understand. Gets white people, nothing mm-hmm. like that. But his mind, mm-hmm. how he how he thinking, how he see things, and how he moves. Yeah, Mike Mike Mike's cerebral with this shit. He mm. cerebral with this shit, and he he know how to set things up a lot. So I, that's a, that's something about Mike. Y'all probably don't know. No, yeah, he cerebral. I, I, I ain't know the boy was uh, calculated. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, real calculated. Um, Mike Epps is a like I said a damn good actor, but have it when he really ain't been he been focusing on his uh, he got that show a dub show damn show it's, dude a dub show dub show so that's what he been doing he been chilling I need to see him in the, on that big screen him and Ice Cube well, you one know, more time well, you know they, they got they, they got it, the man. strike going on right now yeah. that damn right of strike Faison call me about I that man. What the hell is that, man? It's been a long time. Man, money. What Number, the hell is They on strike. They can't get that money. They can't do nothing. Those skits, they ain't going. <laughs> they still getting them residuals from the <laughs> ones that already out. Those ain't going to me, me, ta, ta. What the hell is that? Those skits is going. Those skits going. Those skits going. That motherfucker ain't going to make no movie. I ain't going to write down and drop a skit. So I got to play some. You know what it is. I love face on, man. Man, he dope, bro. I ain't going to lie. He funny as hell. Face up, man. We need to link up me and Face up, man. Hell yeah. He'll be man. out here on New Year's Eve. Yeah. The link. New now, Year's Eve. Damn, mm-hmm. I'm going to be in D.C. No, no, no. We're going to rock it out. We're going to figure it out. Yeah, That's what we're going to do. We're going to figure it out. I got to fuck with the homie, man. That's why, because I, I, I got my, he told me, I got my cameras already. If I get you and him together in a movie, tell I'm going to make a million. Tell tell on Tubi? Nigga, I get y'all on Tubi. Tell me I got some brisket for him. Tell me I got some brisket for him, man. Big slab of brisket nigga, for the homie, man. That nigga on tube and blow that hoe up for man, me. I fuck with Faison. He's standing up dope too. I fuck with oh, the big man. Man, man you much know respect I, to Faison, man. Bro, man, I'll be honest with you. I went to this dude's show, bro. That dude, just like you, showed me so much love, man. It's been a few people that just really rock with Balls Talk One Hundred One. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, Chico Bean too, but I'm just telling yeah. you, man. Faison showed us crazy, man. Love always trying to look out for Boss Talk 101. Gonna call and check on us too. So that's that's live. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. And you, like I said, man, you you every time I talk to you, you in some state, on some state, getting to it. Got to. Got to, man. <laughs> I gotta keep booked. up with y'all, man. Stay booked. Yeah, got to. That's the only way I'm gonna eat. I seen you with uh D L Hughley. Yeah, I bumped into the What the, the hell was yeah, y'all yeah. doing talking? You know he D-L, really D L got D-L on D-L my D-L ass. Too. What what? Oh well. Oh, what did man, he say? Pause, but you know what he. Was, what he, you pausing? What he? What he do? Fussing at me? Why? Like, anything he asked me, I was like, I don't know. I, I'm not. I haven't done it yet. Why? Mm. Oh, he's straight. Let's get it. Like, he give like, me an example of something he asked you. He asked me about a couple of comedy clubs I haven't done yet. 
And I couldn't explain to him why I haven't done him. He got pissed off. He got pissed off like he going to ever want to talk to me again. And I tell him he going to know why I ain't done show. But let me ask you a question. But for you to do a certain comedy show, I mean, a certain comedy club, don't they have to reach out to you and say they want you at their show? Oh, I can reach out to work two ways. That's oh, okay. real. Work That's two real. Ways. That's real. Okay. But he, not only he gave me the connection, he gave me his manager connection too. And made it like, get this brother here. That's good. No That's and that was your first time meeting him? First time meeting him. He knew you or he didn't he know? He knew me. Mm. What'd he say when he seen you? Trash. <laughs> <laughs> What'd he say? Screaming trash when I walked into the room. Tell me love what I do. That's all. Yeah, I'm gonna be big. Wow. I'm gonna be big. Man. Do you get tired of hearing that? Hell no. <laughs> Tell me that. I mean, I'm alive. If I can hear it, I'm alive. I'm living. That's real. I'm, I'm never too old and I never get too big where I, I can't uh, take criticism or, or, or learn from somebody. Because mm -hmm. he's been in the game 25, 30 years. And regardless what the people say, oh, he ain't that funny. He doing something right. Mm -hmm. Motherfucker doing something right. Mm -hmm. Regardless of what people say. They say yeah. Kevin Hart ain't that funny, but he doing something right. Man, I can watch Kevin Hart movies all day. Kayla, mm -hmm. that nigga be having me laughing. I don't know what. It's just the movies, like you said. Movies. movies. We talking about stand-up. Oh. <laughs> oh, like oh, I ain't said. been to a stand-up. I ain't been to a stand-up. Just like they said that um, the Cowboys ain't that good, but they doing oh, something right. Oh, wait a minute. Who said oh, yeah. that? Yeah. See, I'm with you, mom. I'm a, I'm a Thank cowboy you. right now. Like, it's up. But if them motherfuckers lose, <laughs> I'm switching sides. <laughs> you ain't never going to switch sides. Who? You. I'm the biggest flip-flopper in here. Yeah, yeah. You still <laughs> burn that jersey. I'm burn the jersey. He will go there. You better make damn sure you stay on his good side. You better be winning. Uh, you got to win. That's the only way. That's the only win. way, man. So, Texas, man, you know, what, when you look at Texas and, and the co comedians, because the internet got it where... It don't matter where you from. Mm -hmm. Everybody see you everywhere, I mean. Correct, correct. But they, do they even label you as, hey, he from Texas? Most people don't know where you from. No. Yeah, they don't know where you from. Honestly, they look at my... They be like, this nigga is from... Uh, Alabama. They gonna say anywhere. I say Alabama, man. I'm from Texas. I'm from East Texas. I had to correct me, that. Yeah, Alto, Texas. Me, too. Alto. Alto. Alto, Texas, yeah, born and East raised. Texas. Alto, Texas, born and raised. Uh, slash Lufkin, Texas. If you want to say, I spent yeah. quite a few years in Lufkin, Texas as well. But yeah, a lot of people don't think, don't know where I'm from, and I, I have to continue to remind the motherfucker. All they gotta Texas, do is you man. just say Google me. Yeah, that too. Because if you Google you, it shows up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah but this, this, this nigga right here, he ain't got time to wait on Google. He moving fast, yeah, man. Moving and grooving. He moving and grooving. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> say so when you when you think about the the forty years, the trash. What's next? Is there anything else here that you? you I got some. I got some coming over. It's coming. I got some coming. Don't play, man. I got some coming over. He always has some coming up. But no. No, you understand this forty years thing and that trans thing, they different. Yeah, he, he say a lot of stuff and he do a lot of stuff in his stand up. Yeah. But those two things right there are signature moves. It's like chess. This nigga playing chess. I so you, but when it when it comes, nigga, you got to come hard because he already done set up a level that he can't go backwards. Mm -hmm. yeah, I set up some shit that has Shaq screaming. So you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Ain't really too much I can that's 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 I gotta do some shit that's it's hard. Do, I gotta do some shit that's gonna reach Joe Biden. Mm. Joe Biden is he still that president? <laughs> oh, that's an alien. That's what I'm saying, man. Because Joe, like, no, he's a clone. Joe is like Joe, kind of. He's 96. Get the hell out of here, I'm bro. 96, man. Mm -hmm. Joe Biden 96. Why in the hell? I'm gonna he, say it's on boss talk. He, he gonna run the same I want Trump back. What? Hear me out. And I know my black people Didn't they arrest him the other day? I, I hate it. They arrested him. Why you hated it? Let me tell so you he something. can't run. Let me tell y'all something, man. When Trump was in office, it was so many black people had so many, had so much money. Man, they and didn't know what shit. to do with it. But look, but look, now niggas robbing homeless people. <laughs> That's how, ain't that ain't some shit. I'm about to leave here and then rump on somebody. <laughs> Time's hard, my mom. I'm not bullshitting you. You're not playing because. I'm serious. Bro, in LA, they just running in stores. Yeah. Trump was in office, that wasn't going on. Niggas was at Gucci, buying Louis, all Frenchies. I just bought a French. He died big. <laughs> this shit ain't the same no more, man. <laughs> shit ain't the same no more. Frenchy puppy normally had six puppies. Uh -huh. My Frenchy had one pup. Damn. Poor thing. Was a pup diabetic too? Yeah. Stage eight. Damn. Ain't no way a puppy supposed to be stage eight diabetic. 
Biden is I didn't 96. know they had a stage eight. Gang chain. Biden ain't no 96, man. man nigga you run over that. These niggas love that dog more than they love that kid. Mm-hmm. Niggas are veterinarians now. Nigga giving that dog shots, <laughs> worm medicine. Nigga, nigga birthing them, birthing them back to life. The game changed on the Biden. With Trump, you had money to pay people. Mm-hmm. You had food stamps that were getting twenty five hundred dollars food stamps. Joe Biden getting these people three hundred dollars. You having that mm-hmm. bread? Had money on the Trump. Yeah, and I get it. He might be a racist. He might be a bigot. He might be grabbing ye women by their vaginas. So you, you can be bought. Checks. So yeah. you can you, you you can be bought then for the right price. Absolutely. <laughs> 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 now you gonna come to my man, look at my more. Hey, y'all me both. Yeah, well, you know, hey, I'm telling you, they say if you if you make it to Hollywood and you in the move big movies, you go in them rooms, man. I ain't going to them rooms. I'm just saying, give, give, give me the money, give me the money. I ain't going that room. I'm, I'm, I'm a nigga. I'm a peak fur. <laughs> 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 I'm walking different. I ain't going. <laughs> Yeah, I want it, but not what he getting. Nah, you going to rules, man. I want, man that, but look, in order that, for you to get this, you got to go through that. Nah, I ain't got it. Nah, they ain't fucking with me like that. No, I can't do it. No, nah, and... and well, I tell it. Did you ask him would he ever put on a dress? Because he ain't nah, put on no dress. He ain't put on no dress yet. I ain't put no dress. Give him no some time. time. He will. I ain't put on no dress. He give him some time. He ain't doing that. Hell no. For 20 million? 20, you just no. say you can be bought. 20, 30 million? No, that go up. How much would it take? That go up. 100. 100. You gonna go? You yeah, do, do it right now to me. <laughs> <laughs> Look, everybody be like, "You a pussy ass nigga." Man, I can't believe nigga. Fuck y'all, nigga. I got, I got these two M's, nigga. I'm up. <laughs> I ain't putting on no dress though. I don't have to. I'm too funny for that. Yeah, I'm funny without that dress shit, man. Yeah. I'm not doing it. I'ma be a man on boss talk and say I'm not doing that shit. He's standing and I'm up. standing on He's standing on it. Business. You better when not I leave go out this motherfucking room when I get that <laughs> car. Yeah, I go see Holiday hey. Hart Jr. in that <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> He go and said, no, it wasn't Bubba Dub. This is, give me I'm a few minutes. No, this is a bleed in the I'm a lie. It was the perk oh, 30s, man. Right. I was on perk 30 when I, when I put that dress on, fam. <laughs> Hand that money to me right quick, isn't yeah. it? Box. Yeah. Yeah. Right there. I'm good. I'm telling that motherfucker off. <laughs> what color is it? <laughs> oh, that's a, it's got a pink trimming. Nah, what I ain't putting on no dress, That's going to be hard, babe. I ain't uh, going to do it, mom. That's what okay. I'm saying now. What? Until I'm in that room and they, they put that money in my hand and I count and I look at it like, this shit real. Yeah, it's real. <laughs> Man, go on get me my foot. <laughs> Would you do a residency in, in Vegas? Hell yeah. That shit Eddie could you ha- could you could you handle it? Oh yeah. Easy, man. You I see what I'm saying? Cause you gotta do this every night. I'm born for this shit, man. I love this. Hey, you gotta stay stage. in Vegas. Don't they have to live there? Yeah, they gotta they stay. Don't have to they stay. don't have to stay there. Oh, okay. I don't think Eddie Griffin lives there. But he, he he's there though. Mm. Yeah, he has a You know, he make a million dollars a year off that shit. Really? Yeah. Off the residency. Yeah. That's why Celine Dion, she had a residency out there. I Usher. Don't know where. I'll be right there, a million dollars. Hell yeah. What do you think about Usher? Because every time. Be, every time dancing with these girls. With these girls. You don't take her. But I don't take my old lady up there. I'm not going out you there. You take mom up there and he get to come around. Yeah, 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 yeah. He my, bitch, you get bitch. your hand back. <laughs> Slap his hand or something. You, know, you can take a little knife in there like that big. Man, I'm gonna whisper something else earlier. I'm gonna whip, look at fam. I'm start. That. I'm gonna go to him early because I got that privilege. I'm you gonna go, go talk to him. Look, we're gonna come holler at you tonight. All that smooth. Look, look at bro. I would dance on your ass. I'm letting you know right now, nigga. Don't try me. I'm don't telling you, nigga. I'm gonna have that look on my. Own. You see me like that? That man go the other way, fam. What was that girl named the dance with Kiki? Kiki, Kiki Palmer. They said Kiki she was got all, mm-hmm. She should have dressed her. You could see a through but her. But a lot of them, Taraji just danced with him the other day. Ain't Who? nothing wrong with Taraji dancing P. with him if you with she the right no nigga. If you with the right nigga, but if you with the wrong nigga. Taraji ain't got no man. She could dance with whoever. She could dance with me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I ain't going to do that. But if he come over there and you going to tell him to phone. If a woman have a man and a yeah, yeah, is wrong. She know better. She knows she shouldn't get We got her. egos. You gonna do that. You gonna do that. I will shake some goddamn you do some shit like that to me. We get I'm cool for everybody. How you boy I'm good. I do interview. Boy, I'm good. I don't just having a good time. We get in that motherfucking car. <laughs> Bitch, <laughs> <laughs> don't do it. But Kiki Man wasn't there that night with he was her. Soft, man. He was in his feelings like yeah, I would have been. been mm-hmm. over there the game out. changed. These women to cheat on you and cry with you. Damn, you really don't know what to you. do these days. It's crazy. So what? What do you think? Oh, okay, 
Super Bowl prediction outside of Dallas. Who going? Super Bowl. Super Bowl. Why outside of Dallas? I got to because say. Because I know we want Dallas to go. I got to, to say go. Kansas City Chiefs. I can't never go against Mahomes. And man. Mahomes from East Texas. Yeah, man. Right down the road. That's why you say that. No, nah, nah, I mean, he's showing us. He's showing us. I say the Chiefs. Because that's the AFC. NFC. Either it's not the Cowboys, it's going to be the 49ers or the Eagles again. Ain't nobody else beating them, bro. Well, why come Skip keep sliding you, man? Because you got the knowledge. Skip know what it is. You supposed to be on, you and him supposed to be on that show together. Either he, he, he know nervous. He's nervous. He don't want to sit beside you. 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 He don't want to how do you think? Do you think? Okay, podcasting is cold right now. It's going good, right? Mm -hmm. What's next? I always be like, what's next? What's, next what's next? Because podcasting is cool. Don't get me wrong, but and it's sexy right now. Everybody doing it. Everybody got one. I see. But it's too many. It's going water down. I don't know. I don't know. The good ones are gonna be good, and the bad ones gonna be bad, and the average ones gonna be average. Do we see some at the end of the tunnel, or, is, uh, or what? Because. Whatever next, we need to be on it, huh? Streaming. Streaming how? You'll be streaming in Africa. Oh, yeah, that's money. Wherever you stream, right? Because it's always... We are everywhere we're streaming right I now. I know it, but it got, once it blow, it blow, it go. No. You know, the, 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 and, and everybody love the show, and, and I know you watch the show, and Hell, I watch your show, but it's like, damn, man, like, 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 a lot of people be coming up to us like, man, we we love Boss Talk. We I can be at the supermarket. Nigga try to take a picture with me at the uh Your store. At the hamburger. I mean at the mm -hmm. I was buying the hamburger meat. You say get the hamburger meat when you go over there. What kind of meat you buying? It was some hamburger. Now you gotta meat. go to a Mexican meat market. They got the best meat. They damn sure got it. I go, too. I go there too. It's cheap. I go there too. Real talk. But yeah. all the people say you need to go to um, farmers market. That's really the that best too. one. They say that that food better for you. Yeah, they say that's better. You don't have to worry about that. You see him, he don't gain no weight. Or Somebody can be skinny and still be unhealthy. Shit, I got a stomach, man. I'm gaining weight. No, you be old, man. Listen, I see you walk out. When you fit do your ski, I know it's gonna be a good one the way you walk. <laughs> I say that nigga walking today. Oh, I'm finna watch this one. <laughs> How long do it take you to come up with this material, man? Man, split seconds. Seconds? Split seconds. Just think of some shit and just put it together, man. You know, I got a beef with you because I seen Trill talk. He had a skit. I said, man, why ain't never got no skit with Bubba Dub, man? He called me the other day, man. Y'all killed it. That was a long time ago. He yeah, holding it in the vault. He got that over me, man. Trill talk no you know, we know, talk. You know, we known for holding skits. <laughs> 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 and never <laughs> release me. <laughs> you terrible. <laughs> Say, I shake you, man. Man. I'm getting off of that. <laughs> I shake, man. Shit, out here tricking with these hoes. Shit. I seen you the know? nigga. The nigga gave away some money yeah, for a rapper. The nigga yeah, rapping again. Away the money. nigga rapping again. I seen him with zero. This nigga went down through there. Mm. The nigga rapping. Yeah. They did millions of views. He can rap. I said, this nigga been rapping since Phil is my father. He can rap, man. You, you, do you think that, did he move to Texas or he ain't? Yeah, he got a house out here. He got houses everywhere. Yeah, he live out here though. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he live in Dallas. This nigga need to bring, man, he need to come on Boss Talk. Look, Shaq, I mean, I, I know you in Dallas now. It's already out. Bubba Doug let the cat out the bag. I heard you had a house here, but I wasn't sure. Need your ass over here. <laughs> Man, DJ, it's over here, man. So, where's the show at this weekend, man? Because I definitely got to get that part out for sure. Check this out with the Addison Improv. First show, 7.30. Don't worry about it. Sold out. Second it's show, already sold out. It's sold out. Second show, 9.45. Get them tickets right now. It's going down. Man. Addison, but Texas, this it, Sunday night. If that gets sold out, you going to think about adding a 11.45 show? Man, it's up to the club. It won't be up to me. Bro. Oh, okay. I had to get it cleared to get the second show. Cause, you know, cause they just gave me the show two weeks ago, and mm -hmm. I just started promoting it two weeks ago. And, you know, guy is good. I got, the, got great fans who want to come out and see me and support me. So I really do appreciate it. All the love everybody's showing me, even the haters. I appreciate it. We're selling our shows, you know, once upon a time they say I wasn't selling our shows. And then it's funny how time change. Mm -hmm. Want to change up? Want he do it? Sometimes they want you to speak on things. Sometimes you don't have to say nothing. You can sit back and just keep working and grinding and grinding and grinding. And then all of a sudden, there it's you up. go. Want he do it? Want he do it? 
How Man. often do you come out with new content? Uh, I definitely got new content. Talking about stand up or stand skits? Oh, uh, Addison, new 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 um new content. Mm. You won't. But how often? You won't though? see it. I'm it's going, a new year. Going, going, it's a new year. Okay. But if I already done been there, and I come back next year, new material. Okay. So if you but come if back, I ain't been somewhere yet, I can just give them where I've been. Right. You know. So every time you go to uh, the same spot, you new content got every to. single time. Got to. Perfect. You might hear something similar, but I might change it. Okay. But you fucking hear some new shit out the gate. Out got the it. gate, and you see me and my son, and you're like, oh my God, he's got that glow. I never heard that. That shit fire. <laughs> Have you ever had a um, like a bad day? Nope. And still, no, 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 and still had to go up on stage. Hell yeah, all the time. And man. suck that up. Give how all hard the time. is that? It's hard because you comedians we giving that energy. We big on energy, and a lot of times you know people try to fuck up your day, and then you go out there like I'm good, and you go out there and you do your you do your thing, but in your mind like man, I'm not my fucking self. So mm -hmm. I stopped giving people that power of energy mm -hmm. over me. So if I if we on the phone and I feel your energy, I hang up in your face and put my phone on do not disturb. Mm -hmm. Cause I don't want that energy transferred to my crowd who spent the right. hard earned money to come see me. I want to give them bubble dub. I don't want to give them Jerry. Jerry is personal. I want to give them bubble dub the character who they paid their money to see. They ain't paying to see no damn Jerry Morgan. They paying to see bubble dub. So when you come out there, look, my crowd normally go off me. I come out there. High energy, they gonna be high energy. I come mm -hmm. out there, yeah, yeah, they gonna be the same way. So some I come people use there. that and turn it into a comedy. Like you have a bad day, something crazy happened, whatever. It might not even be funny, but they'll come and actually tell what happened, but turn it into a. Some people could do that, but I'm a realist. If I'm fucked up, I'm fucked up. Yeah, that's just me. Got it. If I'm got feeling it. good. I want y'all. You gonna <sighs> feel it? So I'm, I'm a vibe. I go out vibes. I can't fake it. Mm -hmm. so I'm going through some a storm. I'm going through a storm. I guess it's just what it is. I'm human, you know, like everybody else. But I try not to put that off on to my um, my fan base. Definitely. I want to ask you about. Uh, I know you watch. You can't help but see what's going on on the internet algorithmic waves. BG home, nigga. BG is home. <laughs> and not only that, my boy Birdman picked him up, man. When he picked him up, that nigga was happy to get up out of there. I've seen that nigga eyes in his eyes. He's like, I got to get the hell up out of Who here. Who happy? BG or Birdman? BG and BG. Birdman. Birdman, nigga, she, uh, Birdman, she got millions yeah, coming, Yeah, he's to do this eyeball tour, man. I'm ready for it. I, I'm ready, right, man. I think they all need to uh, join LA Fitness and lift yeah. weights and get in shape before they do this shit. Them boys up in age now. And you, get, you just can't run out there and just rap. You know, BG been locked up 15 years. No, it left him, right? Left him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he need to work on his legs and shit. No, but mm -hmm. I thought um, most people, when they're incarcerated, that's all they do all day. He ain't lift no damn like you, way. Right? He ain't he he like you lift no way. Stuff like that. BG, no. Shout out to the humble, but he recovering here on that, man. You know what I'm saying? For 11 years? Yeah. You always you fighting that shit. You fighting it forever. Yeah, and so when you you how you think the music gonna sound? When hey, really the biggest part for me on BG, he ain't made no speech. What music? Who 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 you think? You, you heard what I said? He ain't yeah, made no ain't speech. Heard from so, him yet. So, he so, ain't saying nothing. No. So let's be real. Y'all really think BG for coming home and be jamming? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that nigga, that nigga, that nigga, that nigga gonna be trash. <laughs> no, he not. Don't be talking about BG like that. <laughs> Yo, ain't nobody buying this shit, man. <laughs> no. He got a lot of fans, but a lot of people know BG. BG. Oh, I'm trying, nigga, got fans. <laughs> what is it? Go and get so a lot more glaciers. Hey, BG out here, man, you know they got a meme of him, too, he, where he got that little face. Ain't good. No, it ain't, ain't good. I'm trying to see who from let the somebody <laughs> take this. I'm like, who letting them take pictures of my boy BG? And I'm going to tell you something. Lots of time is that nigga done, they should show him a homage. But the nigga just, they, they caught him slipping. He don't know him about these They're girls. wrong for that. Come back with me and him took that picture. Look right there. I'm right there with him on the wall right there by T.I. picture. That, yeah. That, dude, that BG right was there. Jamming. Before he left. Was jamming. What? <laughs> he gonna be jamming again. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Leave him alone. Wait, hey, okay. we're up in the city. That nigga better, he gotta get his groove back. <laughs> nigga, you, nigga, you say he gonna hey, be jamming. He nigga, gonna be jamming. That nigga gonna be terrible. <laughs> Boy, that's Bubba Dub. Bubba Dub, hell. Look at it. 
But I'm telling you, look, I want that man to get all his money in the world. But I don't want to hear no motherfucking BG. You want to hear it just. I want to hear young niggas coming up that because need the spotlight, no? That need the spotlight that really tell my something. What, what, what BG finna tell us? How many niggas he was whooping? He ain't whoop nobody in there. Ain't nobody finna fight BG in the pen. His status too high. I don't want her no nah, more you, lies. You running the pen. I don't want her no more lies. How many niggas you think rap to I that I want nigga? BG come you on, get his money, take care of his family, and live life. I don't want to hear that nigga. That nigga ain't getting no play in my motherfucking car. <laughs> I'd rather listen to King G. I, I listen to that old BG. I no motherfucker. I ain't listening to that either. Man, <laughs> who is your favorite? Who, who you listen? Who Bubba Dub listen to right who, now? Right now, who I'm yes. like? That nigga that say, bow, bow, bow. <laughs> ah, man. Twisted Black. Oh, that nigga that, that I'm listening to that old Twisted Black and the new one. Shit, that's what I'm listening to. Twisted Black, okay. Zero, Zero okay. Slim Thug, Lil Kiki. But Twisted South Black, Walker. Twisted Black came just came that nigga out from Texas. <laughs> oh, oh, Texas, Texas nigga. Twisted Black just came out Future? and been gone however long. But you listen to him. But BG, he talking about something. BG could have been can be talking yeah, about yeah, something yeah, when he came out. Ain't dropped it yet. That nigga, you see, switch up. If the nigga come jam and he gonna let that nigga live. <laughs> 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 well, he got to come with it. That's all he's saying. But he got to time. come with it. Give him time to put right, it. Hey, hey, wait, Look, wait. we're in a different area, man. These people ain't gonna fuck with BG. They don't even know who he is. Everybody know who BG is. Young been niggas, hearing, 21, don't know no BG. Hearing, they've been hearing free BG for the longest. Man, no, man they ain't saying free, free my uncle. <laughs> they don't know your uncle. It's damn right. They don't know <laughs> BG. <laughs> man, look. Mark my word. They gonna go on tour. They not dropping no album. No, no, they better go on tour. Yeah. They not gonna, they gonna drop a mixtape. Y'all, you really serious? Ain't nobody listening to no goddamn. <laughs> man, stop it, stop it, man. Them niggas, hey, they older, and really, that's what they gonna they gonna do a reunion tour. They don't have to. They, what? <laughs> them niggas, them they, niggas old. They, they gonna, gonna come out though. Them the people gonna bananas. But them people gonna come out for Lil Wayne then when they hit that stage. For Lil, who? Lil Wayne, Lil BG, Wayne? Lil Wayne, yeah. They could bring Drake out. They gonna have to. Them niggas can bring. They it. gonna have to bring Drake, Lil, Lil Wayne. Otherwise, Juvie and B- man, I come out my fuck BG. Nigga, man. Juvie was jamming. Nah, I fuck with Juvie. <laughs> <laughs> but Juvie got a catalog. BG catalog ain't like that. It ain't deep as he. It ain't deep. Now he nigga because I, he I, was I, gone. I, my point is exactly. He can bring Ti. You know him and Ti did a whole that that. Uh, 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 that uh, stand up. You don't like what I'm saying, then? And that was man, Tip doing comedy. He's like, yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. He bring that shit out. Tip music ain't hit like that no more like that. So, so you, you were just with T.I. Yeah, too. T.I. good nigga. He probably ain't comedy. But, but it's that's a shift. It's a shift bruh, right now. Bruh, that just nigga did. just did a song with DJ hey, K. Nah, that song jam. Long with, as with who? you know me. With DJ K. And now Not with solo. It's a shift. It's going to come back. See, people look at T.I. like he already done made it. They don't really want to hear no more. But the nigga jamming. Mm-hmm. So it's a shift. Right now, he's in this comedy zone doing his thing. Another year or two, they're going to be right back on tip again. Like you they used to be. You tip on stage. Tip, how, go, tip go hard, man. How is it? I want to see this. See it. He's supposed to be coming. Look how you look it up. No good. <laughs> when he get, mm-hmm. when he get, when he get on there, I'm, I'm going to see Ti. Not till fun. When he come to the D, I'm going He's to see him. He's supposed to be coming out. Here. He coming when? He coming out. Here. Is he gonna rap or is he gonna what he gonna do? He gonna do his stand up. He ain't gonna go hard in the motherfucker. Does he rap in his stand up? I don't know about that. That's for sure. Uh, <laughs> my arm. Uh, my I got head. <laughs> This nigga, this nigga bubble up. Man, I love you, bro. I want y'all to cry playing. Now, Tip go hard, man. No, nah, I'm going to be honest he, with if you. If he didn't go hard, people could have been done told him. They damn sure so would. So he really doing his thing, guys. I ain't going to knock on. I ain't going to never hate nobody. I fuck with Tip a lot. Tip really doing his thing. It's just different because he's not rapping. He's doing comedy. So mm-hmm. people look at it like, man, that nigga ain't funny. He ain't going to be able to pull this off. He, he pulling it off. He pulling it off. He's pulling it off. And he got good help, too. Shout out to K-Dub now. And the other people now have green now. They he pull the nigga out, man. I can't knock the nigga. That's hard. That's nah, hard. now he can pull this off. Nah, <laughs> BG. <laughs> no, no, hear me out. Cause the dude can rap. It's different if he can rap. It's gonna be hard in this generation. The young niggas. It's gonna be hard. They ain't gonna man. let him make. He it. gonna have to get NBA Youngboy on a song to really 
Bro, I talked to some young niggas and they told me Scarface was trash, man. Who? Scarface. Scarface. Who say face for Some trash? Some young niggas. These young niggas don't care, bro. <laughs> <laughs> they say, we See? don't know who that nigga is. Scarface is old. <laughs> <laughs> so why are you laughing These at that? These young niggas crazy, man. They, it's hard on a nigga. Because it's hard on a nigga. They ain't letting nah, nigga if they, hard, if they say face <laughs> trash, then you know <laughs> ain't got a chance. They better come with it, ain't they? Face trash, never. I'm de- you saying that, but I'm telling you, young niggas at the barbershop, they you're don't older give a damn. Right now. You're not even young no more. I know. I think they booed him one time in Dallas. <laughs> Ooh, <what? laughs> no, they didn't. <laughs> yes, they did. Them young niggas. Pipsy Rose knows the grave right now. <laughs> <laughs> them young niggas don't care. I love face, and I ah. tell you, he the best ever to do it. But these young niggas crazy. Huh? The young niggas crazy. Oh, bitch. Man, I'm a Scarface fan, but PMC, I'm, I'm PMC all day. I ain't even playing I'm with you. I'm Tupac. I'm PMC then Tupac. Only reason, because I've been studying the game lately with Pimp, and Pimp just, he from Texas first of all, but the nigga just, the nigga got, could jam, bro. And he, and musical, he could do things that other people couldn't. He produced and and he make them songs, man. Man, shout out to all these rappers, man. Ain't knocking nobody, man. Y'all keep doing y'all thing, man. They're coming. I'm gonna be looking at. I'm, I'm, I, they're gonna be on you, nigga. You better not slip one time. These, these rappers coming for you, nigga. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I can't slip, baby. Has there been any rappers that mention you in any of their songs yet? Mm, couple, couple rappers. You know, I'm on a song. You know, we all know that. You know, I made history a long time ago on the pop smoke shit. Ooh. Snitching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Send that plaque, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Send, I'm bigger now, nigga. Make me send them Jews at you. Oh, you Jews oh, you. Send that plaque, nigga. Stop playing with me. <laughs> I'm be, I'm asking nicely. Send that plaque. Hey, ain't an invoice coming behind it. Send that <laughs> plaque, nigga. Man. Not nah, so, for real, though. Real talk. Send that plaque. Got to, <laughs> got to have it, man. Thank you for coming on the show, bub. Bubba Dub, how can they get a hold of you? You go Yeah, I can get a hold of me, man, on IG, Bubba Dub 94, TikTok, The Real Bubba Dub, uh, what is it, YouTube. Jerry Bubba Dub Morgan, just Google me. I'm gonna pop up. Just Google me. I'm on tour right now. I'm in Agerson, Texas. This Sunday night, two shows. First show sold out. Nine forty five is available. Dez Bryant, Hollywood Baby, uh, Tony Dorsey, Jay Novacek, Stephen Jones. Damn, gonna be in the building. And me, nigga, Boss Talk. And Boss Talk. We'll be in the building. And Mama in the building. In the building. With the cameras. It's going to, we bring the camera this time. You know he going to interview Jerry I'm Jones. I'm bringing the camera this time. It's going down. Boss Talk 101. Bubba Dub. Hey, man. It's been another great segment of Boss Talk 101. What a boss is talk. And we out.